Hello guys, today we are gonna learn how to see the eyes of our character through the hair. First you have to select your character, go to the UV Maps panel, and create a new UV map. Let's call it Eye. Now we are gonna switch to the UV Editing Workspace, and making sure you have the Eye UV Map selected, go to Edit Mode, and select the parts you want to see through the hair. If you have extra things for your eyes, make sure to select those too. I'm gonna project from view just to have it all together in the UV Editor. Now, we are gonna look for any texture where we have a white spot and a black spot, if you don't have, you can just create a new one, then, with your selection made, place it over the white spot of your texture, then deselect, and select the rest of your face and place that over the black spot of your texture. Now, go to the shader editor and add a UV map node, a texture image node, and a AOV node, and duplicate that last one. Connect this two and select the texture you used or created. If you control shift click that image texture node for a quick review, you should have something like this, where the eyes are white, and the face black. Now, with your UV map and image texture connected, plug that image texture into the value of the AOV output, then, go look for the final color of your texture, whether you are using just an image texture, or in my case, I'm using an anime shadow setup that I add to my base texture, take that and plug it into the color of the other AOV output, now go to the view layer panel, under shader AOV, and add two, leave one with color, and the other one set it value, give it whatever name you want to, each one, just make sure to remember those names. I'm gonna call them IC to the color AOV, and IV to the value AOV. Now go back to your shader editor, and for the AOV node we plugged the value input, write the same name you used for the value AOV, and the same for the other node but give it the color name. We are done with the shader editor. Now, go to the compositing panel, check use nodes if you don't have it checked, let's change this bottom window to 3D viewport, and let's set the render settings to see always what we are doing in the compositor. Let's add a math node and a mix node, if we control shift click the first node we should have the image output, looking normal, I see output showing us only the face, and the IV output showing us the mask. In my case it's not perfectly black because the texture I used wasn't that black but it works for the tutorial, you guys should use a perfect black. Now, plug that image to the first socket of the mix node, the IC to the second socket, and IV should go to the math node, set that to multiply, and we are done. If you don't see anything yet, set your hair texture to blended, and if it looks like this, uncheck transparency overlap. If still not seeing the results, make sure the viewport you are seeing it has the compositor set as always. You can use the math node to control how much of this effect you want to see, if you want just a little, or see everything. There is a second method, just in case you don't want to use an extra UV map and texture. You can just add a RGB node, set it to white and connect it to the value AOV. Select your eyes, duplicate that shader and make it an independent copy, assign the selection to that and delete what we did in the first shader, and that should be it, the rest is absolutely the same. That's all for this tutorial guys, thanks for watching, like and subscribe for more videos.